Now then, YouTube, I have just been out to get a new phone to calm down, had some lunch, all good. Bad news is, you can see there, the 4-0 defeat to Everton, I no longer have gameplay of because I absolutely smashed the shit out of everything you could possibly see. So I got a new phone. <laughs> I've got a... Um, that's all I broke, really, my phone. I just threw it, unfortunately. The uh, protective... Um, cover didn't do much good. It popped out of the protective cover and smashed. So, we've got three more games to record this afternoon, and these are them. Inter away, West Ham at home, and Chelsea at home in the Cup. Like I say, unfortunately, you will th that 4-0 defeat it against Everton, because as I smashed the phone, I also chucked it. My um, laptop fell, what pulled out the Elgato, and the co recording just cancelled, but the game I'd already saved, so I couldn't replay it, unfortunately. So that's unfortunately just missing. But yeah, I lost 4-0. And we're currently playing absolutely shocking in the Premier League. Shocking. There's two games at home we've won. Both of them 2-1. Very good. But we've performed shit. And the two away games lost 2-0 and 4-0. And again, we performed shit. So, yeah, not very good at all. Obviously, deadline day we signed Sergio Reggie on. And he's tired. Here's the team. Ramos and Watkins are fully fit. I'm going to try something different here. Brewster, Watkins, Ramos just behind. Try uh, Sensei. With Gallagher and Berger. Saliba, Kimpembe. Uh, we'll put Corne in. Like that, there's the bench with um, Moussa. So there's the team, because Ramos played really well at Cam. That's one thing I have noticed. I need to try and change something about this team, because currently they are performing absolutely shocking in every single game. I'm hoping now I've come off of um, FIFA at a rest and back on, and that we're refreshed, everything's back to go, and we'll start performing at least even half decently. Let's do it. Our first ever Champions League game. So it is something to be excited about today, that's for sure. We'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, everyone. Well, our venue today is a true football monument. I'm but straight off. It's not started very well. Derek Ray on the commentary gantry. I'm delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the U.S. It's there for him. In it goes. And already, we're one nil down. If I accidentally... Right, I'll tell you what. Two, 2 draw. Fair enough. I want to check something right now. That's a 2 2 draw. I'm not replaying it. A draw away at the San Siro is a perfectly respectable result. Today you're just going to get a slightly longer video. I want to watch. I want to have a look. Settings. Still world class. I was just checking that it's not been moved up to legendary. Because quite simply, lately, it's been ridiculously hard. Right, we're going into the next game. Straight in. Forget Inter. I'm sorry. Um, Chalibur and Philippe with Reggie on. Um, Deliso can play CDM. Sands. Sorry, Berger. Sorry. Yeah, okay. So Poisson, Mulder, Chalaba, Philippe, Region, Taliso, Sensei, Mwepu, Traore, Ramos, Watkins for West Ham today in the game that we are actually going to play. Sorry, I had to just do that because it was constantly bugging me and constantly on my mind. We are still on world class. We just need a shocking run of form. A draw, though, at the San Siro is not the end of the world. 
wrong player already. See how we do. Well done, Sergio Reguilón. Philippe again, not got the pace in mid uh, in the, the back of back of the team, but he's got unbelievable amounts of quality. Shao Ramos turns straight into trouble, and the start of this season. It's gone absolutely abysmally. Philippe. This man is fucking incredible. 36 years of age. Nice ball that Regulon's dealt with really nicely. Traore. Ridiculous save. Traore's ball in to Felipe. It's Felipe, by the way. I, I know this. It's my bad for always calling him Felipe, but uh, Traore. It's a shot just wide by Enoch and Wepu. But yeah, sorry you had to see me just quickly quit the first game against Interval. It went 1 0 down. If I'd have played, I'd have definitely lost. So I'm glad I, I quit and had a look. Because I need that's just, it was I don't I knew I'd have forgot if I'd have carried on till the end of the game, but I just needed to check. Watkins, here's Ramos. Ramos! Good strike, we'll see. Started off okay here though for the first time in since the Super Cup win against Liverpool to be honest with you. Reguillon does well, wins it high up the pitch. Hassan Traore, Watkins, good ball. Ramos takes it wide, back across and it's Hal Ramos. First goal for Sheffield United and it's a lovely goal. It is a really nice goal and a really nice bit of play. And finally, for the first time this season, We've started a game off really well. Watkins, nice turn. Ramos takes that other touch. Could, for some players, be too far out. But Hal Ramos gets his first goal in his fifth game for the club. About time, to be fair. But good to see that he's got that goal. Hopefully the confidence will flow now. The youngster will hopefully get in plenty of goals. No chance. They've hit the bar. And here's Sensei, who has really impressed me this season. Oh, for fuck's sake, scripted pass. What a save from Poussin. Philippe's all day. It's not, you know. Shallop. Bullshit is happening. Get rid. <laughs> Haramos. Just taken out off the ball there. Good advantage from the referee. Sensei. Two nil. Come on, Enoch and Wepu. Nice move, nice move. Really good ball. There's um, Ramos. Ramos to Hassan. Hassan plays it to Enoch and Wepu, and it's an easy finish. Come on, we need this badly. We've had a really poor start to the season. It's already put Premier League hopes. Almost out the question. Better. Tolisso. Sensei. Sensei, Sensei. I don't know how you say it. I'm probably saying it as in phase, Sensei. Uh, but Sensei, I don't know. Stefano. Just wide. See, it's still getting chances as well, the opposition. As you saw, though, there was no um, stopping, um, what do you call it? Um, footage between starting this game and seeing that we're on world class so it's just weird uh, but maybe it's just it was just a really bad run of form that there was nothing I could do about well, I knew there was nothing I could do about it but oh well and he's up quick and the press is on Almost at half time, and they're making home advantage count. I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your oh, could be in here, Enoch and Wepu. Hal Ramos, 3 0. The pressing's been absolutely fantastic, and two for Hal Ramos today. Ramos has officially announced himself in the Sheffield United shirt now. Great ball from Enoch and Wepu, struck hard. 
drilled past the keeper before he has a chance to dive and save it. Two for Jean Ramos. Really happy for him. This has been the first sign today as of Sheffield United as, as an I know they can play. They've been really, really good. Best performance of the season by far. Half time. And Philippe's been phenomenal at the back. Tell you what, fantastic half of football. Finally, improvement. Got to make a sub. We've got to bring off Stefano Sensi and bring on Sander Berger. I love this about this team now as well. The options I've got from the bench is fantastic. Berger and Wepu. Watkins, Ball. Ramos takes it down well, strikes it well. Really, really good performance today from Howard Ramos. Ball in from Hassan Traore. Ramos! Taliso does well there. Oh, it's really shit from Mertel there, though. Well, Derek, this has been a really good performance, as you can see. They've created numerous chances. They're winning the game. Berger. Region. Berger. Really Mwepu. Sander Berger out to Mulder. To play it to. It's Taliso. Hamburg. Shit. Hamburg shit. And here's Felipe again with impeccable positioning. That man has been impeccable today. So was the keeper. He's made some really good saves a few times. Our defence has been breached. Monaco fans have been holding their breath, wondering if the deal was going to go through. It is now official. They can breathe a What a tackle from Sander Berger. Yeah, Taliso. Traore. Ramos. Nice ball. Mwepu. Ball through. For Ollie Watkins. And it's fantastic. Fantastic play. I was really getting concerned because I couldn't see where this bad run of form was going to come to an end. Not even that, there was just the bad run of performances. We've had a, a decent run of results at home. Unlucky Ramos. Trying a bit too hard now. Just to play for the team. Trevor Chalaber, fantastic. Oh, Mulder tried to turn, intercepted, but he was just the wrong side. Trevor Chalaber, immense tackle. Offside. Fantastic. Traore, we've got to bring off. Bring off Sarabia. And we'll bring on Maxwell Corne for Sergio Reguilón. Yeah, like I say, apologies for people for quitting the game against Inter. But I just, I, it was really bugging me, to be quite honest with you. How it was going, how I just could see it so easily, even though I read. I just needed. Ramos! Oh, nearly fell very nicely for Paolo Sarabria. Still, hat trick hunting is Ramos. He's been inspired today. Disappointing start to the season, don't get me wrong. He's on. This is his fifth start. He's only got his first goal, but now he's got one. I'd like to think he can get a couple more. And that's a fantastic save from the keeper. Ramos does really well to win the header, but there's no man up supporting him. The drama of the Carabao Cup. And it's live with us here on EA TV. Philippe does well. Ramos. Really good from um, Philippe at the back there. Sarabia. Well struck, well saved from Pablo Sarabia. 
Ball in. It's Holly Watkins. It's come through to Toledo. I oh, can't quite get to it. Corny's coming over now. Really well done there, Trevor Chalaber. Well Keepers, well done. I wanted to lay that to Jao Ramos to try and give him a hat trick, but not to be. Either way, finally, finally a good performance this season. Obviously, this game consisted of a 2 2 draw away at the San Siro against Inter Milan. We'll take that. It also consisted of a very good win there against. Um, West Ham, 3-0, clean sheet, very good. And as you can see, Premier League table, five games, three wins, two defeats. We're currently seventh. There's only four points between us and top. It's, you know, but we really need to get on a decent run of form. Brewster's whinging, look, I have to rotate the squad. Boss, I've got to be honest, you're doing great. Keep, keep everyone and their moods up. Here we are. So there's two more videos for me to record. Home against Chelsea, away against Fulham. And then we'll start off next recording session with our first home Champions League game. I'll see you next episode for Chelsea at home in the Carabao Cup third round. Like, subscribe. Cheers. Take care. Bye-bye.